The Alliance has four great tasks. First, Bosnia. Bosnia remains an urgent priority. In the months uh, to come, <coughs> the troops on the ground serving and die for will need our full support. Their task is clear, and so is ours in NATO headquarters. We will ensure that they have the support and guidance they need to keep the risk low, to keep the chance of success high, and to do the job in the year that they will be deployed. <coughs> Second, the Alliance has wider strategic interests. Chief among these is to extend stability eastward. NATO's enlargement is the single most important contribution the Alliance can make to the aim of creating a more integrated and united Europe. Partnership for peace will be intensified and will act as a permanent bond between allies and all our partners. Third, I will do my utmost to build a strong relationship with Russia. Russia is a great power. It has an important and unique contribution to make to building a cooperative security structure in Europe. We wish to build a new security architecture with, not against, Russia. Fourth, we have to move ahead with the transformation of NATO. We have to develop even greater military flexibility through the combined joint task force concept, and we have to adapt NATO's internal structure to reflect growing European responsibilities for defense and security. But above all, the function of a Secretary General is to ensure that this alliance remains in prime working order, that it remains the ultimate guarantor of the alliance's security, as well as a means to build broader security for the whole of Europe as we move towards the 21st century. 